you how you can fund your crypto wallet via p2p so you can buy bitcoin buy your ethereum buy your cryptocurrencies on the binance smart chain using the peer-to-peer network so if you're watching this channel for the first time please make sure you hit the subscribe button turn my bell post notification on so when i drop interesting crypto content you will not miss out Without further ado, let's head over to today's video. Please make sure you watch from the beginning to the end of this video so that you will not miss out. Now, you need to open your Binance app and there are many ways you can go to the P2P space of Binance. If you look at the home page of Binance, you will see that there is deposit and there is P2P trading, right? So, if you click on this P2P trading, it will take you to where you can buy your cryptocurrency, you see the price and stuff like that. But for people that want to know the process step by step this is what you do now when you open your binance app you go to wallet from wallet you are going to go to funding when you click on funding you would see various icons and various options you see deposit withdraw transfer and below them below you're going to see p2p p2p is directly below this yellow button this deposit you click on p2p but when you come to p2p you're going to see a lot of traders a lot of people a lot of sellers and the rate and the price they are selling for you refresh now these are various people selling cryptocurrency if you want to buy bitcoin you just scroll to the right you keep scrolling if you want to buy bitcoin if it is bitcoin you want to buy if it is busd if you want to buy bnb ethereum if you want to buy ngn depending on what you want to buy but let's say i want to buy usdt right i'll begin to look for a seller that has there are some things you need to watch out for now if you, if you look at this place you see the name of the seller right on top you see the price then on the right hand side you see the number of trades and the percent so the higher the percent and the higher number of trade would give you more confidence and if you see there's a yellow icon below you see bank transfer you need to check make sure that it is bank transfer so that you would not you know go and contact the wrong trader right so all you need to do is you begin to search for the trader you want now if probably your own is not showing ngn nigeria if you look upward you see this on the top just this yellow part you see p2p and you see ngn if probably it is showing another country you just need to click and search for nigeria now ngn the currency that's the currency you spend here if probably i want to search for traders in us i'll just write usd I click on USD, you see that all the traders you'll be seeing are traders in the United States of America. Or well, let me focus on NGN. You always refresh from time to time. And now let's find. Let's say I want to do a transaction of probably like um eighty thousand dollars or there about, right? All I need to do is to begin to scroll one after the other, and I'll be looking for somebody with a good rate of good success. So this person has eighty one point two one percent. 2614 trade i can probably trade with this person so i'll click on buy right then i'll enter the amount i want to buy let's say by fiat maximum quantity this person doesn't have enough so i just scroll back i keep, I keep scrolling looking for somebody that is doing large transaction to buy from right guys this is where it gets interesting please make sure you watch this video from the beginning to the end okay let's look at this we move let me buy from we move i'm just going to put the amount to see whether it has up to that five is zero fee okay my order has been created all i need to do i can just message and be like hello we move are you there yeah he has replied okay let's run this okay so now all i need to do is he has given me a feedback that was very fast i just need to now come to this play look at we move binance is holding the seller's crypto this is the amount the cryptocurrency i'm going to get to return all i need to do is to now um payment method make payment i click on make payment there are two bank accounts here there's a CUDA, there's a vfd so i'm going to copy this bank account i'm going to copy this right the bank name is um 
Emmanuel Chidera Ude. Right? So I'm going to transfer. Oh, I'm going to go straight to go and do the transfer. Right? I'll go to my Zenit. Oh, them. I'm supposed to do the transfer before. All right, so I have done the transfer. I've done the transfer. I'm going to wait. Once I do the transfer, I'll just let him know I've done the transfer. I did not want to show my bank details. So all you need to do is to just transfer to that account number. Look at this. You have marked the order as paid. Said transfer done. I'll be waiting for him to, to reply, right? Then I'll be waiting for him to give me a feedback. So I'm waiting for him to release. You can see that it is currently showing releasing. Once he releases, it will show that it has been released. And then I'll be expecting to be credited. We said he's on it, right? So let's let's keep waiting. Just want you guys to see how very easy the process is. The only part I did not show you guys is my bank part because I don't want to release my bank details and you know, I don't know who's going to see this video. I should not, you know, be... You understand what I'm saying? Now, look at this. Con confirm successful. Then I'm going to click on done. I've gotten a message to that effect. And the next thing I'll do is I'll just go to my um, Binance. It's going to be in my P2P, right? Look at it. So it is not in my funding. So, so amount of whatever. That is as simple as ABC, and that is how to buy using P2P. There are other ways you can also buy, but this method is the one for Nigerians. If you want to easily buy from Binance without fear, without stress.